Hi guys and welcome back and welcome to another video where you join me on a sunny day where I'm up north in England. I have just arrived at Redline Specialist Cars. I'm sure you know who they are. If you don't, they are the people who sold me my BMW M2 and before that my Audi R8 V10 Plus and most recently my Lamborghini Huracan. Whenever you arrive here, you are greeted with so many incredible cars and I'm gonna give you a tour of what is here in just a second. There is a massive supercar drive happening, a Lamborghini drive. My personal Lamborghini Huracan isn't here. Dean, who helped me source the cars which I now own. He said, Archie, I have a Lamborghini Aventador sitting in my showroom and you can use that. And most recently, Tom TGE, he bought a Lamborghini Aventador S. V. And on that day, if any of you saw that video and when we collected his car, I fell in love with an Aventador S. This is literally my dream spec. I've fallen totally in love with that. That blue that it was in and the experience of an Aventador S, everything was amazing. So in my head, recently, I've been thinking, could an Aventador be next as my next car? And I'm going to be finding out that so much more today. I've been down at Redline today because Archie has just put a deposit down on a Lamborghini Oh, you're filming too. Uh, <laughs> Welcome to Redline. Oh, like I don't like know what, I work here. I don't know what has happened to the weather up here, but it is beautiful. We are taking this Aventador out, and it might tempt me in many sort of ways, but we will see. You're I'm, a Lambo I'm, man. I'm, as well. I'm, I'm intrigued to, to see if I like it. Because this is the first time you've driven an Aventador, right? Yeah, I've never driven one in my life. And here he is, the main man, Dean. High five. How are you, sir? I'm good, thank you. No, <laughs> <laughs> cut it, cut it before. <laughs> no, that's still going. How are you? Are you, are you well? I'm very well. It's very you. cool to be up here. Um, different than I'm not here to buy a car, but I'm sure you might be tempting me to buy a car. I think that's how it works. Yeah, pretty much. It's quite easy to say the order. And I love how you've put the Aventador in the parking space, <laughs> the collection bay. <laughs> we are greeted with a Lamborghini Huracan in this stunning blue. Look at that. That is amazing. One of your favourites? Do you like that? Fantastic. Yeah? Absolutely fantastic. Like that. You talk like that. Top north up here. We have lots of cars at Red Line Specialist Cars. This one's fully spec. You've got the glass engine bay. Um, you've got the same wheels as mine. Style pack. What's the style pack? It's all the high gloss black and the black tailpipes. Oh. oh yeah. First thing I arrived, I saw this stunning RS6, which is just so nice. It just gives you bad ideas coming here. You just want to buy everything. I and it's so annoying. Four or five cars here. Aventador is sat there with Mr. D. It's, this is like a handover. This is hilarious. I love it how he's positioned it to me and he's just like, like I'm just about to buy it. <laughs> this legend, you always make dreams come true if you're buying a car from Redline. He always greets you, he hands it over. I'm gonna use this car for the day, which is amazing. We're going on a supercar driver event and Dean has kindly handed me the keys to this car and by the end of it, he's probably going to say, do you want to buy it? The presence of an Aventador is mental. But we're going to find out how this drives, but it's not about that. I think it's more the fact of you can't beat presence of an Aventador, can you, Dean? No. I've never driven an Aventador before, so to get the chance to drive it today and properly spend a full day in it, it's going to tell me so much whether I could potentially own one of these cars in the future. I've just got in this stunning Porsche Turbo S in this amazing blue, similar to this blue hurricane. How much is this? £169,000. Oh, yes. It's time to fire this bad boy up. Here you can see we've got the start button just here. Flick that up. Paul? Are you ready? Mm -hmm. That is a V12. We're off. Oh look, he's got his cap. Do you know what feels so weird? Is to be able to put these doors down. Like, oh yes. Oh boy. Do you trust my driving? How am I gonna get out? <laughs> it's in the way. Classic dude. <laughs> 
Dean's going in that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's joining the convoy. Oh, right. This is your first drive. First drive in the Ventador. Oh, yes. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put it straight to course for me. Right here. Go on then, lad. Oh, yeah. Hello, boys. Hey. I don't care that the gearbox is slow because it's just mental, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. And it's not that it's not that slow. I was gonna say it's not that bad of driving in a mental. Does it suit me, mate? Yeah. Where are we going? We're going left, mate. Are we going left, you Maybe sure? The on this. Is it left? Oh yeah, it is. Oh left. mate, yeah. that noise. You know the you know when you go like really so it's boom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There the there are the cars. Oh mate, the V12 is so distinctive. Oh. But that! That! When it just opens up the valve. Oh. Do you think I'm not planning on selling the Hurricane any time soon at the moment, but that day will one day... Oh, that noise, I can't, can't get my head around it. This is a potential option. It's definitely an upgrade. Not in the sense of usability. Yeah. Probably a downgrade on that part, but um, V12, 700 brake horsepower. It's a little bit older than your Hurricane. It is. So you haven't got all of the tech that you have at uh, your comforts. No, but do you know what I thought was going to be worse was the gearbox. It's actually like more of an experience. I went like now. It's an experience. It's an experience, isn't it? Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> They're so superior as cars, but not as fun. The Aventador on the road has the most presence out of anything. This is very, very cool. It just feels really surreal. What the weirdest part, oh, I keep getting, can't go over that. It's just how spacious I am. Yeah, Compared loads to the of space. Hurricane, loads of space, like, I can't even touch the dashboard. Yeah. <laughs> well, that just shows it's got loads of space. <laughs> but, like, compared to the Hurricane, it's a lot more comfortable. Yeah. Like, I'm in so much comfort here. It's basically a GT car. It feels like a GT car. It's, it's such a different occasion to the Hurricane. The Hurricane is more pure, like a better, it's a better drive, if that makes sense. Yeah, it does make sense. Uh, gearbox is much better, other things like that. This is, I just wanted to know exactly what this was all about. And I can kind of feel already uh, just what it is. It's just really just mad. And the car like even tracks around a bit. The gears are all clunky. So I think, if you want experience and everything like out there, then an Aventador is your best bet. But if you want a driver's car, a <laughs> racing driver, get a Lotus. <laughs> oh yes. Well, the wing mirror is in the way. Mate, I can't see anything out of this car. Yeah, the visibility. Is... The visibility is like next to nothing. Like, I'm turning in now and there could be like a bus set. I've got no idea. <laughs> oh, we're off, Paul. Oh, whoa! Here we go. The doors are up. The doors are up. So we've just pulled over for our first stop on what is an incredible day with the Lamborghini Aventador. Look at it there with the doors up and everything else. It is just so much fun to drive. Like I say to Paul, it's like terribly good because driving wise, it's just everything you do is like a gear shift. Well, throws you back. You got a bit of a whiplash and everything else. I just had to do it. I just had to do it and drive it just because it's just something I've just wanted to do for so long. And now I can just see what it's all about. I've been a passenger in these cars so many times and I know they're crazy, the experience, but when you drive it and you get the gear shifts and everything else, you get the full experience. Of it. This one is for sale at £199,000. One of the first in the UK right hand drive to be under £200,000. So it's very good value for money. The Aventador S um, being a lot more than that. But I would probably look further towards Aventador S at that time. Just look at it sat there before we go inside. It's just mega, isn't it? That is just so much fun to drive and uh, a hell of an experience. What's your problem? You let me down. Well, because I'm not buying the Aventador. <laughs> Do you want me to buy it? Yeah, you should buy it. Really? Yeah. Go nah. cause you chaos in London on <laughs> We'll have a chat, you know, in the future, you know. I'm sure we will. Yeah, we will. <laughs> and you're nearly on 20,000 followers. Yes. What's your Instagram handle? Go on then. Dean Redline. There we go. Look how good the hurricane looks on the road. Look at that, that blue shining. Stop, 
stop. <laughs> so we have just been driving, well Paul has been driving in the <laughs> and he's revving it. <laughs> and that is rounds off what has been an incredible day with that car. After finally I've driven one and I know what all the fuss is all about and I, I've got the bug for one. Honestly I've got the bug for one. We will see what happens, we really will. Um, see what happens with the Hurricane. I'm not selling it sort of at the moment. Obviously I could never have both but we will see Aventador, Aventador S. I've fully, fully got the bug and this is <laughs> possibly a very bad thing. Look at that, isn't that just a sight to see? Uh, to round off what has been an incredible day, get both of the cars lined up just like that. A massive, massive thank you to Dean. Dean, give us a wave. Dean at Redline, Paul. Make sure you check them out. I'll leave all their links down below. Massive legends accommodating us and giving me an Aventador to play around with for the day. Anyway guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Leave your comments down below. Thank you all. Thank you.